Hello, this paper is about the differential beamforming for linear array. The conventional minimum norm differential beamforming maximizes the WNG but still suffers the low WNG at low frequency bands. And the low WNG at low frequency bands is not good for the practical implementation because this, this problem will amplify the white noise at low frequency bands. So this is not good for the speech. The low frequency bands is very important for the speech recognition or speech capture. And intuitively, the directional microphone could offer better directivity to boost the, the directivity index of entire linear microphone array. So it's impossible to transfer the improvement from DI to WNG for the differential beamforming by use of the directional microphone. So in this paper, the contribution is we propose a method to incorporate acoustic uh, characteristic of the array elements into the design of minimum norm differential beamforming. And in this new method, we could boost the WNG at no frequency band. We can also boost the directivity index. And uh, this depends on the relationship between the narrow position of directional elements and the narrow constraints of the differential beamformer. And uh, you will see this, the picture figure one is a uniform linear array with directional microphones. And the right hand side, you will say if the large position of direction elements is same to the narrow constraints of, of differential beamformer, then the WNG will be improved. If the large position of directional elements is different from the narrow constraints of the differential beamformer, the directivity index of differential beamforming could be improved significantly. Thanks for watching. Bye.